in the red corner, sponsored by Harley Davidson of Erie, Pennsylvania. Uh, Brandon's got stuck in a guillotine, but he's on top, so there's not a lot as much pressure as there would be if he was inside the guard. Looks like um, uh, shot in with that takedown. Right, brought out. Gotcha. Ended up on top. He's, work, he's working to free that leg, free his head. He's doing a good job of hanging on to it. Looks like his head's almost there, dude. Brandon's able to get his head out. Oh, it's been spotted on that. Hip escape by Jake to try to get him back in full guard. Good body shot. He's doing a good job. Okay, well, especially you know here in the Penn State, Pennsylvania, you know you can't hit to the head, so you have to work the body. That's a great way to tire your opponent out. Plus, you got to stay active on top. Yeah, you got to stay active. Too. You gotta stay active, otherwise the referee will stand up here fairly quick because you can't punch the head. So if you're not working for a submission, the referee will stand up and just put around. He knows what to look for. Make, make, sure, yeah, make sure these guys are fighting. Looks like Jake's trying to work a little bit of rubber guard to get that head up. Brandon pops, pops it up. Can't really work for it. Yeah, it be, yeah. Especially with these shin pads on. <laughs> One thing I just haven't figured out here in Pennsylvania with the shin pads. We're getting, we're getting used to it. We've got 10 seconds left to go in the first round. Yeah, definitely. Landed some good body shots. Yeah, Jake threw up a couple of submission pins, but nothing any, nothing anywhere close or anything like that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for these two fighters. Once again, we'd like to invite everybody tonight to Sluggers, the official EFC after party. There's never no cover charge with your EFC wristband. Round two, you ready? Come on, let's go! Come on! Alright, here we go, round two. Jake shoots in for a double. Nice, nice straight. Nice trip. Brandon does a good job to get back to his feet. Uh-oh. He's got the choke in. Brandon's doing a good job. He's got two on one. He's just got that one. Yep. He's working hard. He's a, oh, oh, yeah. And Jake gets it. Congratulations, Jake. Yep, tapped him out, round two. Yeah, uh, I didn't see it. I would, I did, and I didn't throw my clock. Yep, start, yep, grab that. 25 seconds, round two for our winner. Red corner, Jake Spock. Give it up for Jake Spock. Spock. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm standing here with Brandon Fang. A hey, tough fight, you know, you went through that first round on top, you know, dominant position. Jake threw a couple of submission attempts at you, but you fought through them. You know, landed a lot of body shots in that first round. Uh, what was going through your head after that first round, going into the second? I was real confident after that first round. I thought I'd uh, come through with the same game plan. Yeah, you shot in with a nice double leg, with an you know, outside leg trip. Got you on the, your, you know, on the back, you know, you got straight with position. Uh, you know, he just was able to get that rear naked choke in real deep. Uh, hey, congratulations to a great fight, man. You know, you're an impressive fighter. You come from a good camp. We look forward to having you back here at the UFC. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a big round of applause for Brandon Fang. Hey, Brandon, real quick, anybody like to thank tonight? Uh, this is my family for coming out, uh, friends, all my coaches, all my gym partners, and my girl. Uh, <laughs> all, right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, once again, Brandon Fang, let's hear it for him. All right, now I'm here with your winner, Jake Spuck. Congratulations. Nice fight. Um, you know, like, 
talk with Brandon. You came out first round. You went in for that takedown. Brandon was able to get on top. You know, it was uh, landing some good body shots. You were working for some uh, submissions from the bottom. Um, what you know, what was your game plan coming into tonight's fight? Uh, you know what? I'm a wrestler, but I'm developing. Um, always looking for the takedown, but you know, and giving up a lot of reach. Uh, I gotta lose some weight and drop to 45. I'm gonna keep doing this. He's a strong kid. Even for 55, he's a strong kid. So obviously, I want to take him to the ground, and when that didn't work, you, know, you gotta you gotta improvise. So. All right, well, you know, coming out in that second round, you immediately shot in for that double, and like I said, you got that outside leg trip on him. Immediately went to the ground, scrambled, sunk in that choke. He was doing a good job trying to defend two-on-one. Um, you were able to get that victory. Congratulations. Anybody like to thank tonight? Uh, everyone for coming out. Um, Steve, Aaron, Dave, uh, all my corner men, uh, Nora, Jim. Matt. Thank you, Jim. And my gym team, Nowhere. Thank you. All right, Matt. Uh, Jake, we look forward to having you back here in the UFC. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Jake Spock. <laughs>